beloved people of God, I've come on here to tell somebody today, pay attention. Pay attention. Pay attention to the signs, the wonders. Pay attention to the favor that the Lord is placing over your life right now. Pay attention because it's all leading up to something greater. It's all leading up to something greater, you guys. I believe that in my spirit. I woke up today so excited. So filled with so much joy, so much positivity, so much happiness. And then, come on, the Lord is delivering message to all his prophets. His prophets and his prophetess. Okay, there's 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 change coming. There's winds of change coming. There's a shaking happening. Okay, like there there's something that's about to happen. I need you to perceive it today. There's something good that's coming. And and pay attention to the signs. If you're somebody who's up next for your breakthrough, you're going to start to see the signs. You're going to start to see favor. You're going to start to see people wanting to bless you. You're going to start to want to bless others. You're going to want to you're going to start to see um uh just changes in 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 those areas in your life that that you've been believing in God for. If it's your health, your your mindset on things is going to start to change. You're going to start to feel a little better. Hallelujah. You're going to start to see test results changing. All right? If it's finances, you're going to start to see changes in your finances. You're going to start to see little blessings here and there. Just little bits, little little I I'll call them breadcrumbs, but I don't like to necessarily say breadcrumbs just because any blessing from God, big or small, it could be that the Lord just dropped a penny on my windshield, you know, hopefully you don't crack it, but <laughs> it's, it's God's goodness. I'm telling you, it's, it's, it's from God. It's good, period. I'm sharing this message today to give you guys a small little testimony of just the goodness of God. So the other day I was thinking about, you know, you know, my finances and stuff, praying to God about my finances, praying to him for what's going on in my life and just believing in God for more. I wasn't sad, but I'm like, Lord, I know that I can trust you with this. So let me pray to you about this and ask you for it. And, um, as I was praying, I got a notification on my phone and I'm just like, dang, what, what is this? What could this be? It was somebody who sowed into my ministry and I'm so grateful for it. The little, the, the, what people call small, um, sewing or whatever it doesn't is I don't I don't like to think of it that way and it wasn't like a huge amount either that some people will call huge but it was a blessing to me and I prayed over that seed I prayed heavily over that seed and I just know that the Lord is going to bless that person who uh sowed into the who sowed into the ministry I just know it and so um I didn't have really any money and I was saving that money because somebody blessed me on paypal and um i didn't have i wanted to not cash out that money into my bank account because i wanted to just save it let it grow from there save it for when i really need it but um i really needed it (laughs) because i needed to put gas in my car and so i went over to the gas station and i i uh cashed it out into my bank account and um I was going to put like $15 in my gas tank because I knew that would be enough to get me around today, uh, get me around for the errands I had to run. So I went up inside the store to run my card so I can get gas. And um, I go up there and I'm trying to type in like the little like phone number for like the discount and it said declined. And I'm like, okay, that's fine. He's like, do you want to try it again? I'm like, no, it's fine. It's fine. I'm not going to worry about it. It's only like a few cents anyway. I went to go swipe my card finally so I could pay for the gas. And um, I was like, okay, cool. Like it, it took out the gas. I it was said At first it started to say declined, but then it said approved. And I was looking at my card and the money was not taken out. So I go to put my gas. I'm thinking, okay, well, I'm using Cash App. So you guys know how Cash App is. It can be a little funny. It can be a little slow, right? Um, So I just was like, uh, it'll take it out eventually. You know, it'll happen in a couple hours or overnight. It'll reflect on my account. No, you guys. No. That money is still there on my account. That $15 that I was going to use to, pot, to put gas in my card and put gas in my car mind you this is money that somebody had sold over a word that i had um the uh, 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 a message that i had left on one of my youtube videos they sold into that word you guys and i prayed over that seed now if i use that money to go put gas in my car 
and I was holding on to that money because I, I'm like, I'm going to need this at some point. I was holding on to that money, but I used it to go get gas and it didn't take it, but I was still able to get gas. I knew it was God. I knew it was God. I know that that was a, just a small portion of a blessing from the Lord. And I know on the other end of it, the person who sold into whatever word that was, that they're being blessed right now. No matter how small the seed is, I know that the Lord is blessing them because they blessed me. And to me, that was confirmation, you guys. It was confirmation to me that there was a blessing going both ways. Not just for myself, but also for that person. It was amazing. It was really amazing. It was truly a blessing. It was like that money was not, it could not be touched. It just seemed like that, that seed, that seed that was there, it couldn't be touched. It couldn't be, it couldn't be altered or taken away from. But just that small little thing that happened, like it just made me more aware that there's blessings that are coming and the Lord is just doing like little things here and there to just really like bless his children and to really just show us like hey i'm coming through for you just imagine god saying that to you today right now i'm coming through for you the things that you're believing in me for they're coming here's like a little a little token of of the greater thing that's coming let me just show you that i'm here let me just show you that there's blessings in store for you I believe that's what God is doing today. I need you guys to pay attention to the signs today that the Lord is about to come through for you. He's about to bless you. He's about to turn your life around. He is about to turn your life around. I I just want to know, like, and I keep hearing, I keep hearing in my spirit. Do you perceive it? Let me know if you perceive it today that the Lord is about to turn everything around. There's no limits to what he's going to do. Don't limit God. Do you perceive it, beloved? Change is coming. The, The change is here. It's now. It's happening. You are encouraged to sow into this word, whether it be here with my channel or with anywhere else your church or with another ministry so into these words you know it's important that we sow into these words like that was just a small testimony of the goodness of god and and what sowing does how it blesses the receiver and also the sender so into these words leave this video a like leave a comment down below if this word resonated with you if this is confirmation for you also leave your prayer request down below if you feel so led because I'm praying for people. I know I have this anointing for prayer and I want to pray for you. Leave your comments down below. Make sure that you share this video with somebody who needs to see it and make sure that you're subscribed to this YouTube channel. Make sure your bell notifications are turned on. That way you get alerts on every time that I post and I'll see you in my next video. I love you all so much and you have a blessed day.